Where do they come from? Hmm, that's right, in Egypt. So where in Egypt? Let's find a mummy. Are you ready? Wow, what is this? This is a sphinx. What is a sphinx? A sphinx is a mythical creature with the body of a lion and the head of a human. This sphinx protected pyramids. What is a pyramid? A pyramid is a tomb for the pharaoh, the Egyptian king. It is humongous. Let's go inside. Wow, there's a room inside. What is that gold thing? It looks so beautiful. This is called a sarcophagus. A mummy was laid down inside this beautiful coffin. Finally, we found a mummy. Why do you think they made mummies? 5,000 years ago, Egypt was a very advanced civilization near the Nile River. This highly sophisticated kingdom was ruled by the pharaoh who had so much power. Whatever he decided, came the law. So, the people made a mummy for him. Ancient Egyptians believed in eternal life called after death. They believed people had a Ka and a Ba. Both of them were spirit forms. Ka was a life force that needed to eat food. Ba could move around like a ghost and could travel to the stars. In the after death, they can live as long as Ka and Ba were united inside a body. So that is why they made the mummy. It is where Ba and Ka can come back together. They also made a space for the pharaoh to live and enjoy life after death. They put furniture, things to do, stuff he used while alive, and painted on the walls and statues. Hmm, that is interesting. They have their own language. This is called Egyptian hieroglyphs. They wrote spells and stories on the wall. It is how we know so much about their history and their philosophy from 5,000 years ago. Isn't that cool? We've learned about why ancient Egyptians made mummies. We also know they thought that the after death was very important. And we know more about their life and how they thought 5,000 years ago by looking at their paintings. Ancient Egyptian paintings can be seen on wall painting or papyrus painting. Wall painting has two styles, painting on a flat wall and painting over wall carving. Papyrus painting was painted on papyrus paper. Papyrus paper is made out of a plant called papyrus. They slice the papyrus trunk very thin and weave the bark together. Let's see some ancient Egyptian painting. Look, this painting style looks very strange to us now. But Egyptian artists had strict rules for drawing humans. They did not try to make the pictures realistic. Instead, they wanted the picture to represent the ideal and harmonious human form. Because that would be important in the after death. Ancient Egyptian artists wanted their king to reach the after death. So they used not one perspective, but many perspectives. The face, arm, and leg were drawn from the side. Chest and eyes were drawn from the front. In other words, they pursued to describe the permanent and perfect human body. Another interesting fact is the more important a person, the bigger the drawing. We can measure the importance. Isn't that fun? What do you think about ancient Egyptians? Let's create art like an ancient Egyptian.
like this video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.